There used to be the smallest church in the world. It used to be up there too. We used to play in that too. Uh, that's that's been moved about 30 years ago. Of course, I'm almost 60, so when I say we used to play in it, I'm talking 50 years ago. <laughs> so yeah, I'm, my name is Glenn Davis. Glenn Davis. I grew up in uh, up here in the subdivision. Yep. We used to run around those woods up there all the time. Had no idea what it was, but it was the monks that used to, you know, own all this property and lived up here and everything. That's why it's called Monte Casino, you know, because the monks owned it. Well, when, I, when we were little kids, we would uh, we would go down over the hills, and we discovered the first thing that we discovered was uh, a man-made creek or a creek. It was a creek bed that was man-made, you know, by rocks in the formation, and actually it runs all the way from. Uh, Monty Lane all the way down into Latonia. And about halfway down there, there was a big giant rock, probably about half as big as a small sized car, I guess. And they, they apparently they put it over the top of it to make like a little a, a bridge on it that the monks used to, used to use. There was these rock walls that are, you know, obviously man-made. And some of them are about 10, 12, 15 feet high. There used to be a big giant wine vat. Now at the top it was probably about four feet by four feet, but once you went down in there, which we did because we were, you know, ten-year-old kids, yeah. and it was about twelve feet deep. Yeah, one time I got stuck down there for like an hour until they found a tree, oh, a, a tree strong enough that I could climb back up because it was about twelve, fifteen feet deep. So I think I made it down to the Monk Bridge, or what they're calling the Monk Bridge. Pretty sure that's what that is. A very large stone that straddles this stone lined creek. This stone lined creek bed stretches on for a very, very long time. Oh, there's so many down trees. It's been a struggle to get this far, and I think I'm only about a third of the way down. So I'm on my way back up, and I'm back to the first stone terrace. I, uh, I came from, from over there, which is because I didn't know that there's... Let's see, I'm doing this without being able to see myself, so... There's a set of stairs right here, and uh, that's pretty cool. There's a set of stone stairs that lead down to this creek. And the creek, for a good portion of it, is actually lined stones. So this looks like it's... It's like a little glade right at the top of the uh, of the stones, right before the right before you get to the stone steps. It also looks like it's part of the drainage system. So the stone steps are back that way. And I'll flip the camera around and I'll look at the glade. So yeah, it's grass pretty empty that's why I'm thinking this is part of the flood area this probably pulls with water quite a bit before it starts to get over the wall grounds a little squishy but it's you know it's regular dirt this mess of down trees I thought was basically impassable that's how I got down here is through the center of these down trees so I'm gonna Maybe take a couple of still images for the sake of 3D to get back out of here. Again, this is just through that last photo. And then this, which again appears to be impassable. But, this is how I got down here, so I know I got through here. I'm gonna try to figure it out. Let's see, oh, fall in a fucking hole. Underneath, okay. Let's go underneath some stuff. More underneath. 
Ah, oh, this is why I wear safety glasses. Because of this kind of stuff. Ouch. Yep. Alright, almost. Almost. Almost through. Not quite. Let's go up on top of these. No, no, let's just go through. I'm pretty sure I came through on top of them, not in this fashion. Oh, oh gonna have to go lower. Got trapped. Bye. That was a fucking mess. Ouch, I think I just cut myself. All right, I'm through. I just came through that almost imperceptible gap. And I think that when I went down there, I actually went over the top of those logs. That was the way I went. And this is the way back out. All right. The new dumping sign should be right where that bunch of clear space is. All right, so I'm back. Obviously that no dumping sign. But that pathway right down here, that's the way. You see Monty that way. Oop, fell in a hole. And more that way.